Hello everyone and welcome back to Zakilt Educational Channel. So in this video, we will know about how to prepare for the next attempt for UGC NET Environmental Science paper. Tips to know what are the steps you should follow, what are the things you should avoid. So all these important things we will be discussing in this video. So watch this video carefully. So without wasting much time, let's start today's video. So the first and very important thing to continue your preparation for the next exam is that you should be having your response sheet of the past examinations. It is not about a single exam which is the last exam which you have appeared but before that also if you have appeared for two or three attempts all the response sheets you should be having. Yes, many students are having the fear of failure and that's why they are not at all downloading their response sheets and they are not checking their answer before the answer keys are released this is a very bad habit and this will make your preparation a little bit tougher because those who have downloaded their paper and response sheet they will get an edge I will tell you how they will get an edge and how you will also get a benefit if you have downloaded your response sheet so you should download the response sheet whenever you are appearing for the exam by thinking that no I will see the results at the end only so this is not a good habit because this will lead to one step behind the success you will be one step behind and those people those who have downloaded their response sheet how i will tell you so here this is the response sheet this is for the paper 2 of environmental science of the last attempt so if you are having this thing you have to analyze your own paper yes if you have attempted for the previous years also if you are having multiple attempts two or three times all the response sheet of your own you should be having in order to prepare for the next exam much more efficiently because this is going to help you in the examination how it will help and how to do your analysis i will tell you so, so this table you have to make after you have downloaded your response sheet after you will start analyzing your own response sheet yes in first column you should write all the units of the paper 2 that is environmental science we are dealing with paper 2 unit 1 fundamentals of environmental sciences unit 2 environmental chemistry unit 3 environmental biology environmental geosciences energy and environment environmental pollution and control solid and hazardous waste management environmental assessment management and legislation statistical approaches and modeling in environmental sciences contemporary environmental issues so apart from the passage thing all these 10 units you should write and here for example you should write number of questions were asked from this unit this you will only get to know if you will download the response sheet if you have downloaded and you have to take the print out hard copy you should have print out of your own response sheet and after analyzing all the questions you will be able to mark number of questions coming from the environmental chemistry for example from environmental chemistry six questions came you will write here six and then you will check from those six questions how many questions you have correctly answered you are having the answer key also so if you have not downloaded the answer key, you have done the second mistake. So answer key also, if you check from there, you will get to know how many questions you have done correct in the environmental chemistry, for example, in the unit two. For example, you have done four questions, correct answer. And similarly, in the environmental geoscience, eight questions came and you have done only two questions correctly. So if you will fill all these things at the end, you will get to know about all the 100 questions, excepting the passage, it will be 90 questions. So all the 90 questions, you can check which are your weak zones, which are your strong zones. Yes, from that, you will be able to know that which areas you need to focus more and what are the areas which are your strength. So for those candidates, those who have not downloaded their own response sheet, I will give a suggestion. You can take the response sheet from your friend even if you can comment me in the, our comment section we will provide you the response sheet and there you have to solve again that question paper because you don't know what were your responses so one by one first thing is number of questions you have to mark how many questions came from each unit after analyzing the paper completely only you will write and then you have to solve your paper again to know number of questions you are running doing it correctly so you will also get to know which is your strength zone and which is your weak zone and you can act accordingly and study accordingly so I hope it is clear now. Let's move on to the next slide. So now you are having the response sheet. You are having all the questions. So what we'll be doing you will that. So for example, this is the question came in the last exam for the environmental sciences UGC net. It was the match the following. Identify, it is not the match the following. Identify the correctly written with the place of origin. Environmental moments were given. And which are the correctly matched pair you have to select. So here it was given Apico moment Kerala. 
बिश्नोई मोमेंट इन राजस्थान गंधमर्दन मोमेंट उड़ीसा जंगल बचाओ मोमेंट बिहार साइलेंट वैली मोमेंट इन कर्नाटका सो आई गिव यू सेटन सेकेंड्स टू थिंक एंड देन वी विल नो हाउ टू मेक द नोट्स हाउ टू नो द आंसर एंड ऑल दिस थिंग्स सो हियर ओनली थ्री ऑप्शन आर करेक्टली मैच बिश्नोई मोमेंट सेवनटीन हंड्रेड स्टार्टेड इन राजस्थान गंधमर्दन मोमेंट इन ओडिशा इन नाइनटीन एटी थ्री जंगल बचाओ मोमेंट इन नाइनटीन एटी टू इन बिहार सो बी सी डी आर करेक्ट ऑप्शन सो यू विल हिट दिस ऑप्शन एंड यू वुड हैव गॉट द फुल मार्क्स इन दिस क्वेश्चन सो नाउ द वर्क इज नॉट फिनिश्ड यू शुड नॉट सॉल्व द क्वेश्चन लाइक दिस वन मोर स्टेप आई हेड यू हैव टू गो वॉट यू हैव टू डू लेट अस मूव ऑन टू द नेक्स्ट लाइन so this is the way in which you will be making your own notes from the question if you know the answer after that you have to make notes from there for example it was given apico moment 1983 you should mention short notes like this in your note it was originated in karnataka it was inspired by the chipko moment in uttarakhand and it was aimed to save forest in western ghats and who was the leader you should know also the leader name pandurang hegde was the leader in apico moment Similarly, Bishnoi movement started in 1700s, originated in Rajasthan. Bishnoi, we all know. So, jokes apart, Bishnoi movement originated in Rajasthan in 18th century when Amrita Devi Bishnoi and others sacrificed their lives to protect trees. So, leader was Amrita Devi Bishnoi. Next, Gandhamadan movement, 1983. It took place in Odisha to protect the Gandhamadan hills. It is the hills from mining activities. So you should know what was the cause and what thing they are protecting. The leaders were environmental activists from the local communities, including the leadership of the Gandhamadan Suraksha Yuba Parishad. So these are the notes you you should be making from the questions. Even if you know the answer, you should make the notes because the questions will be coming in the twisted form in the next exam from here only. They are not going to give the questions. questions from any other planet some questions will be very difficult but not that all so you should skip those some question and make these notes in order to prepare efficiently so next is jangal bachao moment 1982 the jangal bachao moment was started in bihar now it is in jharkhand to protect tribal lands and forest from deforestation leaders were the local tribal leaders and activist next let's move so for some points you can write more in your notes for example silent valley moment in 1973 it took place in kerala it aimed to protect the silent valley from being flooded due to a proposed hydroelectric project yes there was a proposed hydroelectric project so people wanted to save that valley from being fl uh, flooded so this silent valley moment took place participants of the silent valley moment you should know that kerala shastra sahitya parishad kssp silent valley samrakshana samiti svss kerala forest research institute kfri world wildlife fund wwf so it is an international conservation organization you should know this thing and salim ali a renowned ornithologist who was a vocal critic of this project madhav gadgil sugata kumari sugata kumari also one of the leaders for this silent valley movement she was a poet and an environmental activist she wrote a poem called marathino stuti which is called as o to a tree that became a rallying cry for this movement so these are some of the notes which you can make from the question itself which will help you to prepare more efficiently and in the revision just need to go through all these notes and you will be much confident before the exam so now some more tips in order to prepare efficiently for the next coming examination first thing is read a book 10 times rather than reading 10 books at once so this was given by a zakli team member prasun sarkar who qualified ugc net in june 2024 so you should not read so many books and make yourself confused and complicated read a book which is a good book different units are having different books to study we have prepared a separate video as you can see here on the left hand side how to qualify ugc net jrf smart strategies books to follow so these things you should follow i will provide the link in the i button if you haven't check this video also in the description this will give you a overall idea how to prepare it's a 30 minutes video watch it carefully next is never underestimate paper 1 many students are thinking paper 1 is nothing we can do all these maths are there we can do the reasoning all these things but paper 1 is actually mark fetching ugc net paper 2 syllabus nobody can do all the units easily because it's a very vast thing but paper 1 one, one can easily complete all the units and score more marks there is no paper wise cut off if your paper 1 is going up even if your paper 2 is little bit lower mark then you will be able to also qualify net jrf or net ls if your paper 1 is having good score next is attend the zakli daily quiz and prepare notes from them many students are thinking that why to attend the quiz 
but those who are attending the daily quiz they are getting to know so many new things you are giving the current affairs also so you can also join our telegram page learn for the environment and you are conducting daily quizzes so attend the quiz and make notes from there and also point wise notes you should also make from the daily quiz it will definitely help you because all the students those who have qualified jrf and net ls they are always telling that thanks to the zaclit quiz because it is helping them in order to revise in order to know new things so this will keep you on track for the revision thing so these were some of the things which will definitely help you and give you an edge over other students those who are not going in this way so if you like this don't forget to subscribe our channel exactly and hit the notification to get further updates you can join our instagram page environment science preparation for the current affairs and short notes so see you guys in our next video till then keep preparing and believe in yourself